Like, I don't care about those things. Come on. We're the fucking Empire. Like, I don't care about these underground monsters. Lift. Leader capacity. Yay. Alien zoo. We could Yay. use one of those. <laughs> yeah, let's do the alien zoo. My first? And we got tons of debris out here. Did our science ship ever come in? At your command. Where are you? You're getting close. I'm afraid to move my fleet now. Comlink construction. In fact, you guys just land. Mostly I don't want to move my fleet because if they start sending more troops in here, like my science ship is gonna get caught out, and that's not cool. Exactly like that. No, 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 no. No. Alright, I'm just gonna put them in passive mode. I'm gonna tell them to research the projects in the system. And we'll just hold our fleet here for a little bit because the tech that we get out of this is actually really good. Or should be really good. Um... Battle cruisers, carriers, two unknowns. A cruiser, a cruiser one, cruiser two. Yeah, I mean, that's a decent fleet. I'm not worried about that. Yeah. Looks like they're gonna send another fleet to die. Communications have been established with the Curator Lambda Enclave. Alright, cool, cool. No, it. Chill out, lady. <laughs> Our science ship! No! No, 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 don't jump out. Excuse me? I don't know what I did there. Uh, we got a tradition. Protection racket, or every vassal increases. Yeah, that one. Since we have vassals and not tributaries. And then once we finish this, I mean, they're doing stuff over here, so I guess I can just move up to Aragor, Egror. Dr. Sponge, excellent. Faction founded. Citizen Self-Determination Society. It looks like we won the war. Ah, uh, with horrible, horrible Bordegor. I have no idea why I wasn't the war leader, but... I guess we'll deal with it. Alright, let's pause for a second. We're going to deal with the aftermath here. We have unemployment. Because of this. Um, I mean, what do I do with these people? Impoverished conditions, caste system, planet habitability. What is this planet? Hey, what's up, Hepatus? Hepta... Puss. <laughs> oh, did it not update? I hit update, but sometimes it doesn't work. Error could not update stream information. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let me try reloading the dashboard. Yeah, I did attempt to update, but for whatever reason, my version of Google Chrome has issues. Updating the uh, Twitch stream information. Let me know if it changes. It should be correct now, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I bet they do. It is. Well, it looks like Hephaestus to me. Like the Greek. Was he a Titan? I think he was a Titan. I don't think he was a god. But, that's clearly not what it is. I mean, these guys are going to be enslaved. I can't really... Migration attraction, but nobody's going to move here. Planet outputs, a decent amount of energy, pretty good amount of food as well. I think... Well... 
People that work food get enslaved, right? That didn't change. No, it didn't change. All right, so we're going to probably turn this into a food planet. At least until we can, like, gene mod our people. Awesome, it's correct now. Yeah, thanks for letting me know, because, I mean, there's no way for me to tell in the Twitch dashboard. It doesn't... It says that the information is what I typed in, but it doesn't actually update sometimes. So, yeah, we're just going to, like... Uh... Are you guys good at anything? You're venerable. Natural physicists. But you're never going to be happy here. You're like egalitarian and stuff, so we're just going to set you as undesirables. Actually, I can go species here. Set rights. Um, pop controls enabled. And... Undesirables, they are going to... You know, freak out and result and stuff. Revolt. And that'll be good. And yeah, we're just gonna let all of these guys migrate away. Ooh. Hepatitis followed. Thank you, man. Um. Yeah, I think we're done here. Yeah, you can intermix races. The, uh, really the defining factor, like, you can move people just about anywhere. I think it's, if they have 60% habitability, which is determined by technology and their starting planet. Um, if you have 60% habitability, you can move a race onto it. So, you know, different races can overlap, and then you can get into, like, modifying species genes specific to a planet like on a planet you'll be like everybody here now gets this gene or whatever and so you can change their ha their uh, planet preference but I don't have that technology right now and they're just gonna be unhappy and a real pain in my a real thorn in my side for a while so I'm just gonna set them as undesirables and try to get them out of my empire we could get gene mod points and gene modification It's tempting, but then I have to deal with their ethos as well. Converting ethos is the real issue. Because they are... Well, xenophiles are fine, but the uh, egalitarians here are not going to go very well in my empire. Oh, as in interbreeding. No, not really, yeah. The gene modding is about as close as you can get, but it doesn't change the portraits or anything like that. Let's, let's get this, because it would be nice to be able to tailor our citizens a little bit here and there. Yeah, we won the war. We combat stats, no access. Um, our fleets are going to come home eventually. We should have access, though. Oh, no, we were up in goal. That's right. They're pathetic and wary. Hegemonic imperialists, they're xenophiles, militarists, and authoritarian. They should be our friends. That is, like, 100% friend material for us. I think... What can we do? We can offer a trade deal? Maybe? Yeah, wary. They don't want to do research. But I can, like, give them star charts. Just to make them a little bit happier with us. Um, we can guarantee their independence, which isn't a bad idea. And just allow them to, like, realize that we're not a threat to them. Because we're really not. What's my truce timer? 2305. Yeah, we got a little while. Alright, well, we're going to wait for our fleets to come home. Our transport fleet, I'm going to send straight to Trism in case those underground people decide to make any trouble. Oh yeah, we have too many colonized systems. That is going in a sector. So, I, yeah, definitely can't put that into the same sector. So we're going to have to make another sector, which is fine. Um, the sector is going to have a lot of trouble is the only real issue. 
Tomb World, huh? Maybe we can colonize that in the future. Alright, they are happy with the gift. Not aggression packed. Really? Alright, so they're trying to get chummy. Which I don't like. They're overwhelming and domineering. If I were to declare war, my vassal would come in, but yeah, we don't have an alliance here. We only have a defense pact. Uh, I don't think that we can do an alliance. Interesting. We can do a federation, but federations are kind of garbage. Federations are fine with players because you can kind of do diplomacy, but with the AI, it's kind of terrible. Like just missing resources. Yeah, I know. There, have some resources. I don't know what you're going to do with it, but... Demand of vas vassalization. I'm going to say no. Who is this? You are rivaling you? You guys should be, like, best friends. Interesting. That's the wrong rival to pick, but okay. <sighs> Unfortunately, we still have this bug where we can't meet these people. I want these guys to open their borders to me. Oh, they did. So, my science ship should be able to go into Gaul and continue his research? No, because he's missing in action. Uh, where is the other science ship? There's one way out. What? Oh, you're surveying. Okay. Yeah, you're all far away. Alright, well, I'll let them do their thing. Still have unrest here. I should probably just build some garrison troops to try and deal with this. Not aggression pack. Yeah, sure, whatever. Nah, let's let's keep the guarantee until we can get our science ship out there. What do we have here? Fractal ship? Let's go ahead and research that. And yeah, we need to continue building up our infrastructure. Grade that. We are short on physics research. You guys are the pissy ones, but, you know, we need more science. Let's go ahead and build another science lab there. You guys are getting double bonuses, huh? Yeah, silo and planetary capital. That's nice. I like that. Uh, Terminus here. You are actually kind of growing now. You're doing pretty well. I think we're going to continue to just produce food and energy here. I think that makes the most sense. You can upgrade. We can clear this tile. I think this I'm just going to turn into a pure science planet. We can get rid of like the energy and minerals and stuff. We don't really need that. Yeah. And you just have a lot of growing to do. Again, physics research is what we're short on. We have a... Okay, they broke their pack. They started a non-aggression pack and then broke it like immediately. 
repairs complete. We did get our science ship back. Can we send him to research projects? We can. And our transport fleet come out here in case those underground people decide to try and rise up or something. Construction complete. Alright, getting some construction done. <laughs> Food, minerals, eh. Society output is increased. So, this might actually be another good science planet. Let's... Do a bit of science. Unrest Terror. After a period of mounting tension, the unrest at Pavonic Terramex has resulted in terrorist action. While casualties and property damage were minimal, the faith in the Galactic Empire's ability to protect its citizens were shaken. Yeah, I don't... I could give a shit what these guys think. One thing I... Do you need to do it's like build a robot or something I can't build robots I don't have droids hmm construction complete well how am I gonna keep this planet once they all migrate away Tile blocker cleared. I guess I can gene mod like a single person once we get the tech system survey complete if I go into the species tab, I can't gene mod as is, right? No. Yeah. We will get the tech soon. And yeah, I'll just migrate a person over there that is capable of handling that climate, I think. You guys should probably get modded as well. That jungle world isn't exactly going to be... An amazing place for you. We can get the quantum destabilizers, which is actually a pretty sweet defense platform module. Or we started a bunch of pretty sweet ooh, sapient combat combat simulations. That's a pretty sweet tech. We can also go straight to hyper shield so we can Completely bypass advanced shields, which I like. It's really expensive. How long is that going to take? 113 months. <sighs> 10 years. I think we... Might be better off getting other techs in the meantime. Probably going for physics lab... I think we're going to pass on the destabilizer. It is a rare tech. It might not show up again, but it probably will. It usually does. Xeno anthropologists. Several Xeno anthropologists from New Coruscant return to the surface of Trigon Prime after spending a great deal of time living among the subterranean aliens native to that world. They learned much about the ancient ways of, and customs, which will no doubt benefit our society research. All right, so we get some society out of that. That's sweet. Construction complete. We should be able to build, yep, a Batharian power plant. That's great. Did we get Xeno zoos yet? We did. Put that alien zoo down. I mean, we could build just about anything here. But we should pick something specific. I honestly think energy and science is probably the right way to go. We're going to put science lab on here. Systems you are going to get a science lab. And yeah, we're just gonna, you know, energy is energy uh, tiles are gonna get power plants, and the rest is gonna be science and or society. 
debris getting analyzed that's good stuff another reason to wait on picking out those texts that we have partially researched 